we'll trim this up today so that we'll have them shorter and they'll focus on producing an actual tomato. Because of the seasons here in New Brunswick, it can be a little bit hard to integrate growing in the curriculum. The possibilities are really endless when you look at hydroponics because everything we used to be able to just do at the end of June or early September can now be done from September to June. Oh yeah, those are flowers. These little ones. Yeah, they're, gonna, they're flowers that are gonna turn into a 90% of the kids end up with a at-home garden. Kids, miraculously, will eat their vegetables if they grow it themselves. They know, I grew this, and without me, you wouldn't be eating that lettuce on your sandwich. With the grant, we're actually not just growing produce, but we're also educating the whole school about what's going on. So when we do grow our produce, it's done in the cafeteria because it's central. All classes get to visit it. We also started um, a growers group series, so where we post an episode every few months about what's happening with our hydroponics. It is completely student driven. We've integrated all kinds of different technology, so it's not just about growing anymore. A lot of the kids have started looking at the leaves of the things we grow and creating art. But without those funds, none of this would have been possible. The teachers and community members stop by our cafeteria all the time to snap pictures. They get invested in it. They've been eating it. Um, they've been supporting our club buying the lettuce that we produce. The plants can grow just like a tiny box and not just like out in the outdoors. So the plan in my mind is to work at one vegetable a year and to try to really produce enough that we can stock the cafeteria for all of that one produce. We did uh, ground cherries. We grew them hydroponically. It is not a seed that was approved for the hydroponic system. We were very excited when it germinated. Very, very healthy. Look at how thick the stalk is. Yeah. It is a very, very thick stalk. Um, so I think more experimental uh, seeds are in our future to try out in these hydroponic systems.